In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to add name servers in Namecheap, and we'll do this in just five minutes. Adding and configuring name servers can initially seem like a daunting task, but don't worry. Together, we'll break it down into simple, manageable steps. Whether you're new to domain management or just need a refresher, these steps will guide you seamlessly through the process. To start off, once you have your web browser open, you'll need to visit the Namecheap website. On the homepage, look towards the top right corner and you'll see the account option. With a simple click, you'll be directed to a login page. Here, you'll need to enter your username and password into the respective fields. If you haven't set up your Namecheap account yet, you'll first need to do that. But for our purposes here, we'll assume that you have an account ready to go. Having entered your credentials, click on the sign in and continue button. Once you've successfully signed in, it's time to go to your dashboard. The dashboard is essentially your command center on Namecheap, where you can manage all your domains and related settings. To get there, click on the dashboard link and you'll be taken straight to it. Now that you're in the dashboard, you need to find the domain you want to manage. On the list of domains near the domain you're interested in, you'll see an option labeled Manage. Click on that. This will open up the domain settings page for that specific domain, a place where you can make all sorts of adjustments to your domain setup. Once you're in the domain settings, you'll find a section labeled Name Servers. Click there and it will reveal a drop down menu. Here, you might see a default setting like Namecheap Basic DNS. To customize this, you need to alter this setting. So click on that drop down menu and select Custom DNS from the options. Now comes the time to enter the specific name servers you want to use. In the custom DNS fields that appear, type in the name servers you've been provided with or the ones you intend to use. Remember to double check you've entered them correctly, as any errors here might lead to connectivity issues. Finally, once you have typed in the name servers, don't forget to save your changes. You'll see a save button. Clicking it will apply all the adjustments you've made. It's important to note that it might take some time for these changes to propagate across the internet, so a bit of patience might be needed here. Helping to ensure your domain directs correctly is an essential task, and by completing these steps, you've successfully added name servers to your Namecheap account. Feel free to revisit this video anytime you need to make adjustments or repeat this process.